All right, so this is how you make a slideshow in iMovie. First, open up iMovie, and then under your movie library, um, just so you don't get confused and you can keep things organized, uh, right click on the iMovie library and hit new event, and add in the couple's name, whoever you're doing. So say if it's like Tom and Christina or something like that. And then from there, you want to import your images. So you just click on import, and then it brings up the box to wherever your photos are at. And from there, you can import import the photos. I already imported some images under Carson and Todd, so I'll show you how to do it from here. So once all your photos are imported, select the pictures. You can hit Control A and select all of them. And then just drag them in your timeline. Boom, drag them in there. And then once they're in there, then what I usually do is just kind of, uh, you can organize them however you want. So you can move the photos, you know, get it in like chronological order. And then once they're all set, don't even worry about adding in the music yet. Just once once all the photos are in the order that you want them in, then what I do is you hi you go back and you highlight all the pictures. So click on the first photo, and then you click on the last photo, <clears throat> and then right click, and then it'll say add cross dissolve. Boom. So all the images have a nice cross dissolve in them. And then go to audio, which is up here. Boom. Find your song that you want to add in. And then you just drag it in there. Like so. And then sometimes either your song is too long or too short. And the way that I fix that is you just take all your images again, highlight them all. Then you go to this little button, the I button, info, and from there you can adjust all the slides to have a certain time. So say if you're, there is probably like an easier way to do this part. This is kind of like a guessing game. I usually have, uh, I usually start the images around 2.5 seconds and see where that gets me. Sometimes when I do that, it fucks up the audio. So I just go back and I delete the audio and then I just add it back in. Uh, and then you can just see where it matches up. And uh, <clears throat> let me delete these because, shit. Okay, so here's one, here's a full slideshow that I did. So where I threw in all the images, highlighted the whole thing, right clicked, add the cross dissolve, throw in the, the song you want, and then you can go back and highlight the images again, and go to the info button, type in the time you want, and then it'll adjust it. And this song happened to be four minutes, and that's like about how long the images were once I selected them and did two and a half seconds. Side note, for some reason there is sometimes a default with photos in iMovie. They like to do that Ken Burns effect. So what you'll want to do also when you highlight all the photos to make them uh, two and a half seconds or three seconds, go over to the crop section right here and make sure that it's on fit and not on the Ken Burns thing. And then you'll be good to go. See? Boom. Boom. And then slide this over right on cue.